For our YouTubers, Facebookers and Instagrammers, I'm here for a slightly different episode today. A question that I get asked a lot is, what kit am I wearing, for example? And I'll just talk you through some of the stuff that you might have seen me use and some of the stuff that I'm going to be replacing. Um, so a lot of my clothing is fishing clothing, um, and mainly carp brands such as ESP, another company called Corda, and another company called Fox. I'm not being paid to say any of this. These are just brands that I've brought over from my fishing background and I, I, the clothes has a very good crossover. It tends to be well made, warm, waterproof and the correct color khaki obviously um, so one of the things i get asked an awful lot is what boots do i wear well my eagles which are quite a well-known brand are literally coming to the end of their life and to be fair they've had holes in them for over a year and i think it's fair to say with a hole that size and if you see the one on the back of this boot look at that that's an emergency exit i've been wearing these pretty much like this for the last year stubbornly not wanting to get rid of them they've been pretty good they've lasted me about three years they're neoprene lined i think they were about 150 pounds when they bought them they also do a full zip version of these i do like the eagles i think that they are probably slightly harder wearing than the shamus which i've replaced them with now i've had i'm going to show you these now the shamus these are the fashion brand the french brand everyone loves them We've got spa shop colleges up the road and I can always tell the spa shop students because they've always got shamu boots on and they always have the Gucci ones which have the zip all the way down. Now they are about £300 for the neoprene lined ones. These are about £200. Um, I went for these because predominantly I'm wearing salopettes over them so I don't have access to the zip anyway. Um, and for me, it doesn't make any difference getting my foot in and out of them. I don't have a, a high instep or anything that causes me a problem to get them on out. So for these are perfectly good for me. Personally, in previous years, I found the shamus didn't last quite as long. I'd be interested to know your thoughts as well. Where I'm constantly taking them off at the heels, they tend to go here. Um, but um, at my local store where I needed some new boots, I was like, I'm just fed up with the rain and I can't get wet feet any longer. Um, so I've just opted to get these because they didn't have the eagles in stock. Um, so we'll go for the, with the shamus and see how they uh, last out. I used to go for a pair about every nine or ten months. That's how much I used to wear them and they would wear out and the eagles were definitely lasting longer but i've got these we're going to see if the if the quality's changed on them you'll also see me wearing these spanish riding boots you can get them from the spanish riding boot company if you google that uh, again not a sponsored link in any way at all i bought these with my own money i really like them especially for summer work um, when the ground is dry i don't get lots of rubbish going down the outside of my boots and i don't get hot feet which is the key for me in the summer months if you wear sort of normal boots or trainers, you can still get a lot of crap going down the side and it can be quite irritating. So these are great options. Fantastic for early September partridge, walking on stubble. You don't get too hot in them. They don't really offer any water resistance, but they are, uh, they are right for the right job at the right time. Um, and as I said, you'll see me wearing salopettes. That's probably the thing I get asked about most of all. As I said, my favorite brand is probably ESP. Again, not sponsored anywhere, so I just like the brand. Um, you'll see me wearing their hats quite a lot also. Uh, all their clothing is really, really good. But Corda and Fox are also very, very good. If you go into your local fishing centre, they often do salopettes and a jacket for a really good price. Sometimes as little as 60 quid, you can get both, which is fantastic. Anyway, bit of a different video. Hope this is some help. As I said, in no way uh, am I being paid to say anything. This is just my own personal choice and what I've decided to do. Um, be interested to hear your thoughts on the uh, brands that you use and what you think of them. That'd be really interesting to hear. Otherwise, happy training guys, catch you soon.